just saying I think it was a little rude to go down the slope in front of me. We weren't really skiing. They posted the pictures in the story. My first credit in a major magazine. Look. Photos by Missy Mesa. Missy Mesa? Well, close enough. OK, let me see, let me see. Joe leaves Fiona for fake blonde. Fake blonde? I'm in the big time now. I had to spice it up. Besides, no one will know you're the mystery woman. <laughs> ah, the mystery woman. Bye. Ah! I knew it was you the minute I saw the fake blonde hair. OK, you know what? That's oh. You think the press is just going to drop me and focus on you? Well, they always side with the wounded girlfriend. You're not my girlfriend. Of course I am. That's why you bought me this diamond bracelet for my birthday. Wow. I'm a big spender. And all I got for my birthday was a macrame guitar strap that said, rock on. Thanks a lot. OK, you know what? You cannot keep this up. Sooner or later, people are going to realize that this is all fake. And what are you going to say when the press asks you what it is about Joe that you love so much? Easy. His fame, his success, his fans, all superficial. They're going to see right through it. Really? And what will his mystery woman say she loves about him? OK, I'm not going to pretend to be in love with Joe, but if I was, I would say the way he flips his hair out of his eyes and the way he grins when he gets nervous and his heart. Well, it looks to me like we have a love triangle the press is going to suck up with a straw. I can't live like this. Oh, that's good. Joe can't live without Fiona. Will you please just go away? I am begging you. Oh, don't beg, honey. It's not pretty. Guess what else isn't pretty? Who are you? I'm Missy Mesa, blogger, Jonas Fan Club president, and as of today, the owner of a very rare Fiona Sky photo. Or should I say, Bertha Snurkis. My ninth grade yearbook photo? Where did you get that? From my newest fan club member. Oh, and here's your hat. <laughs> I think the only headline that will prevent this photo from being released is Fiona Sky breaks up with Joe. Paolo, after all you've done for me, this is how you repay me? Don't speak to me. Way to go, Macy. Oh, I better hurry if I want to be the first to post about your breakup. Stella, so do you really like those things you said you like about me? Oh, um, I, I don't really remember what I said. Oh, yeah, I think it had something to do with the way he flips his hair. You know, out of his eyes, like... It looks better with... not my hair. Did I say that? It's, it's funny, I don't remember. It was like two minutes ago. Yeah, I think you also mentioned that you like the way he grins when he's nervous, kind of like this. Mm. All right, doesn't look good on my face. I get it. And you also said you think that I'm super hot, so... OK, I did not say that. Yeah, she didn't, she didn't say that. Yeah, you did. I so did not. Joe, now it's your turn. What? Yeah, Joe, tell us three things you love about Stella. Well... I gotta go. Oh, yeah? Well, your smile's nothing special, you know. Oh, who am I kidding? He's adorable. It would have been kind of cool to be known as the mystery girl in Joe's life. Hey, it's the fake blonde! Hey, the fake blonde has a name! It's Stella Malone! You can thank me later.